And the last one, use a circle to find the following. So here we're going to look for um, a few different things. The first one is going to be x. Okay, so um, here, see, or this is the center is p. So that's circle p. And then we have um, b c, and we have c d being congruent. We have this being a semicircle. Okay, so here x. Um, how do we find x? Well, this one right here, arc BAE is, a, is um, 180 degrees because it's a semicircle. So I can just take this x, add it to 5x, and um, make that equal to 180. So 5x plus x equals 180. That's 6x equals 180. Divide the 6. x, or x is equal to 30. The next one, uh, measure of angle C, P, D, okay, C, P, D. Now to find this one, we're, that's, um, we know that this is 30, okay, this is 150, so <coughs> for the rest, the remaining angle measures, the central angles, um, we want to look for this one. Now, since we know that this is 30, this one and this one are congruent because the arcs are congruent. Well, um, here, we know that this is also a semicircle. So if I label this, let's say, um, what variable should I use? Let's say I'm gonna label this as Y. Then this angle will also be Y. That means this one plus this plus that is going to equal 180. So I'm, I can do 180 equals 30 plus y plus the y. So 180 equals 30 plus 2y. That's 150 since I subtract the 30 equals 2y. I'm going to divide the 2. I'm going to get 75 equals y. So y we know is the measure of angle CPD. Okay, so this will be 75 degrees. This is 75. This is also 75. And this one will be 30. Now this is 30. And I know that because, um, well, this is vertical angles, right? Okay, since this is a diameter, EB is a diameter, so these will be vertical angles. Or you can also say that this BCE, this whole um, right here is a semicircle. It's going to um, add up to 180. Okay, so then that's 30. So measure of arc ED. Measure of arc ED. Well, the central angle right here is 30, so then this has to be 30 degrees. And the measure of arc EAC, so EAC, all of this together, okay? So this right here, 150 and 30 and 75. So this measure of arc EAC, is going to equal 150 plus 30 plus 75. Okay, so this is 180 plus 75, which is going to be 255. Okay, so that's the answer there. is 30. Okay, so that is it for this lesson. Thank you for watching educator.com.